Welcome back, everybody. Today, I'm opening up Shiny Treasures. Y'all suggested that I pick some up, so I did. I've got two boxes here, but I'm only going to open up one of them. The other one might go into my sealed collection, but that's not all I am doing in this video. I will be revealing the CGC submission that I sent last time. This will be number five submission that I sent in, and hopefully you guys enjoy this video. So, which one do we pick, left or right? Let's go right. So this is my first time ever opening up a Japanese booster box. I do have some other Japanese stuff sealed in my collection. I just haven't opened it because I'm still not familiar enough with all of the thousand plus Pokemon that they are. So let's see how this goes. I've looked at the best cards. We are looking for the Iono, Charizard, Card of War. There's a Penny, Mew, Pikachu, Mimikyu. There's a whole bunch of cards that I would like to pull. Let's just go ahead and rip in it. I think the card trick is three to the front. I'm not sure, so let's do Let's try it. Three. Here we go. All right. I think we're gonna count EX and higher better. Let's hit, ooh, our first one, guys. We got one of the Charizard. I think there's three Charizards in this set. What an awesome card to start it off. We'll just set this back there. Hopefully the rest of this box is as awesome as that looking Charizard, so let's find out. This is so different than American cards, but the packs are longer. It's so weird. Probably got it upside down now. Let's see, we're gonna do one, two, three. <clears throat> All right, we got the Iono, I know that one. What else can we get? That shiny, that's a nice looking card. And then we got another EX, guys. I don't know, do EX cards come in every pack? I don't know. If this is a good card too, guys, let me know. Moving on to the next one. See what I'm saying? Keep doing three. I think that's a card trick. I'm not sure if I'm wrong. Please let me know in the comments. What do we have? I got another EX Gardevoir, but it's not. It's not the one I'm looking for. This is just a RR. Is that regular rare? <coughs> Excuse me. I should have looked up the. The meaning of the letters in Japanese, the Japanese cards. I got three EXs. Again, let me know if that's good. These little pull tab things, terrible, just terrible. Ah, I got that one. Dolphin. Another shiny, right? And another EX. I'm telling you, they're in like every pack. I don't understand what's going on. I like it. I'm just going to steal up all the EXs. I'm going to have to look up all these cards after I'm done with the video. See if any of those hollows, shinies, are actually good. I'm looking at the top 10 cards right now. I've got it pulled up on my computer, so. Two, three, I think it's upside down. Let's see. Nope. Oh, Quaxley, I think. Let's 
It's the Charmander. Another EX. All right. Is there an EX in every, I'm telling you, every pack so far. It's way better pull rates than American, that's for sure. If the EX cards are any good. Struggle is real. One, two, three. This one's upside down. I knew it was going to happen eventually. Let's say... Another EX. Look, there's the EX. <laughs> See, this shows how much... I know about Japanese cards. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. That one opened up pretty good. Just gotta grip the top of it really hard. All right, we got a building. What else do we got? Mailbox. I got a chunky squirrel, another EX. Okay. All right, I'm beginning to think that these aren't worth anything. Well, I'm sure they're worth something, but just, it's not the cards that we want to pull. Maybe I will open up that second box in another video. Pidgeot, another Charmander. Ooh, that's an awesome looking card. And we got another one behind it. Okay, okay. Stack it right there. We got two more packs. Two more packs of shiny treasures. Are the pull rates better with Japanese or are they better with English cards? If you know the answer, please leave it in the comment. Here we go. Got a bull, ring, or a belt. Little mice, something else. What's the EX going to be on this one? We got the Mew EX. Look at that one. It's not the Mew that we're looking for. Okay, this is crazy. Probably pulling out all the worst cards. And <coughs> Excuse me again. Setting aside all the good cards. Last pack, can we get some last pack magic? Come on. There we go. We Coco, whoops, we got. All right, another EX. I don't, another sh shiny, right? Same as the uh, hollow and American cards. I don't know. So every single pack had an EX. Right, that's pretty cool. I like that. I wish American cards are like that. So let's run through these real quick, guys. Ah, here we go. We got the Mew, I know that one. Crocolore, I think, something like that. I don't know what that is. Huh? Gardevoir, right? And then Charizard DX. Okay. Those are what I think are the hits from <laughs> my first Japanese box opening. Shiny Treasures. Now we're gonna move on to something that I know more about the English cards. This is my fifth submission to CGC. We've got some pretty awesome grades in here. I'm gonna try not to reveal the grades before I pull them. You might be able to tell because of the color of the numbers. So let's just start off. I'll put these in order from the cheapest raw to the most expensive raw. So here we go. We're going to start off with Gardevoir EX, 
if you saw my last video, I pulled another one of these. I'll send that in in my next submission. What did we get on this one? We got a nine, mint nine. Okay. Okay, not too bad. This is another Gardevoir EX from Scarlet and Violet. What is this one? 9.5. Okay. They are getting better. Let's see, we can already see that. Look, you see, already see the 10. Can't do that. I'm going to have to hold it up like this, I think. Got the Charizard EX from Obsidian Flames. You already saw the grade. There it is. Gem Mint 10. I think this is the most 10s I've ever gotten in a submission before. So that's pretty cool. The next one is another Charizard EX from Obsidian Flames. And we got another Gem Mint 10. What do we have next? We got the Alakazam from Scarlet and Violet 151. What did we get on this one? 8.5. That's all right. Here we go. Moving on to the next one. We got the Palkia from Crown Zenith. And we got a 9.5. There are some better grades in here, I promise you. We got the Venusaur from Scarlet and Violet 151, and we got a 9.5. Moving on. Oh, did y'all see that? Sylveon from Evolving Skies that I pulled just a few weeks ago from a random pack of Evolving Skies. We've got a pristine 10, guys. This is my first pristine 10. How awesome is that? All right, moving on to the next one. We've got three more cards, I believe. Here is the Iono from Pau Day Evolved. And we've got a Gem Mint 10. We'll take it. We'll take it. I'm liking all these 10s. Look at this one. Y'all already know what this is, right? Another Iono from Padeo Evolved. Another pristine 10. How awesome is that? All right, last card. I'm really disappointed in this one. This is the Charizard from 151. Here we go. It's got a terrible grade. We got a 8.5. But that's okay. I was looking at it closer and there's some whitening. You can see in that corner, that corner. Wasn't as great of a card as I thought it was going to be, but that's all right. That's going to be it for this video, everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. We will see you next time.